Hello, I am Heather Durham, a mixed media visual artist from the beautiful island of Antigua and Barbuda. In a minute, I'll give you a tour of my studio and the work that I have been doing recently. But generally speaking, my art is about being black, being woman, being self-empowered, being Caribbean. There's something inside of you that tells you that there's something that was unfulfilled, but this has always been my passion. I've never wanted to. I can remember being a very small child and my dad asking me, what is it I intend to do with my life? And at that young age, all I said was one word, art. And then he would say, what are you gonna do with that? And whatever. I wish he was alive to see what I did with it. I was there for three years, did um, textiles, because I was very much drawn to fabrics, anything to do with fabrics. So I did the printing of the fabrics, the dyeing of it and stuff. And then I came back to my alma mater and taught for a short time. And then I went off to Savannah College in Georgia to do my master's degree. And that was in fibers. While there, I maintained a 4.0 throughout, so I was who is who in American colleges and university. My work was selected to represent the school at the Venice Biennale in Italy, the largest modern art show in the world. And the list of that goes on. Then I came back. I, after that, I did director of culture and stuff like that. And recently, I was teaching at the Teachers College because of my love of teaching. I tried to keep a balance of both, doing art and teaching. And then I started these adult classes for teach, you know, people art. I used to hold them up at BBC. People are supporting me and they see the value in my work and they can relate to the work. Because I have to tell you, when a person walks into the studio, you know, they would walk around and immediately they would stop in front of a piece or they will keep coming back to that piece. And that's what I want, that connection they would make. I can remember several occasions, a person would look at a painting and the, I heard the person's voice kind of breaking. And I said, what is it? And she said, no, no, that's, that's it, that's the piece. They made a connection with the painting of the woman that I had done. They saw something in it sometimes, not even what I saw in the beginning when I was doing it. They made a connection with her eyes, maybe her look or something like that. And that to me is, that is the satisfaction that I get. That's the heartwarming part of it. That a person makes a connection with something that I did and can relate to what I was trying to say in that piece of art. That to me is priceless. Throughout my life and my artist career, I always wanted to project where I'm from because I think the Caribbean and my island is like some of the most beautiful places in the world. And what's important to me is to showcase the aspects of it that really just seems so beautiful to me. It always has to have palm trees in it. It always has to have sunsets and, and sea and the little houses, you'll see some of the little houses. And you always have to have my seabirds. That's like a signature of mine. So there's a whole series of these, which you'll see in a minute, and it's called My Caribbean Aesthetics. These are the things about my Caribbean that I, the colors, look at the colors. Look at the colors of the sunset, the colors of the sea, all those different shades of blues. And so two things I work on at the same time. So my Caribbean aesthetics is one of them. Ladies and gentlemen, now that you've had a tour of my studio, I am Heather Durham, visual artist from the beautiful island of Antigua and Barbuda. And I want you to know that my artwork is available to the world. All my pieces are available on both functional and decorative items on website www.redbubble.com. I would like to take this opportunity to welcome you all to this warm, lush, beautiful island with great food, lovely historic site and warm and friendly persons. Once again, my artwork will be on show at the Expo. So have a look, have a look at my bio. And I welcome you all once again to come and visit my island, Antigua and Barbuda. <music>